Right. Hi YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, all the possible platforms all along, all along, all together. Um, why am I doing this? I'm doing this because I see way too many people around me um, struggling, being unhappy, um, lost for why is life so mean to me and I am the saddest person in the world and my boss hates me and my job sucks and I hate Mondays, right? We see this all the time and I can't, I'm, I'm sick of it. I can't take it anymore. I'm, I'm honestly frustrated with how people are not in tune with themselves. They're not clear on what they want, why they feel the way they do. Um, and a lot of the times when you speak to them, there's quite a large breakthrough moment when you, know, you ask them basic questions that, that they don't have the answers to. And we all seem to fall in this trap. We live in this, in this game of life without knowing the rules and the rules we build ourselves are rules that you know they've been engraved in our mindset when we were kids when we were way younger than we are now um, regardless of how old you are um, and i find this to be quite shocking to me at least um, there's quite a lot of room for improvement in all of us and um, gary v uh, talks about all this um, um, motivation uh, issues that people have and how you know it's all of the the things that he says he quite clearly says you know this is for the people who whine this is for the people who are unhappy this is for the people who you know you're lazy and you, you know where you want to be well exactly why right because after all these you know after all the effort you've put in, if you're still not where you want to be, right, you gotta review. A friend called me the other day and he said, can you help me out? I have problems in my relationship. I don't understand this girl. And I asked him, okay, um, what is it that, you know, what is the reason you, you got in a relationship? Oh, uh, started thinking. He, he couldn't answer it. Um, well, because, you know, you want to be with someone. And I was like, for what? Is there anything specific that you want to you wanna achieve? Is there, you know, why do you want to be in a relationship? Or oh, everybody else is in a relationship, I have to be in one. Do you? Is that what you need? And... I'm sure he'll watch this and it's one of these moments where, you know, even he realized that it's not really the need for a relationship, it's the need to fill in a gap that you're uncomfortable with and you find a method to do it by finding another person, you know, using that person as, as a fulfillment to that need. Quite a lot of the time we feel as we are halves, right? We say, I want to find my other half. There is no other half, right? God has built you complete and you are a human being. You, you cannot, you function without another person. You don't need another person to function, right? Yes, an, you know, another person in your life who you share your life with would be, you know, would be twice as pleasurable. But the purpose of relationship is to magnify our emotions. It's to magnify our experience in life, right? A lot of times people don't use it, don't use it for this. You know, when they're sad, they, they try to find someone, you know, that can comfort them. And guess what? When you're sad, you feel sad, you attract someone who is also kind of sad, you know? Um, or alternatively, you can attract someone who's the opposite, and then if you don't adjust and you don't find the qualities in yourself that the other person has, then it's like, well, why are you, why are you sad all the time? Why are you crying all the time, right? If the other person was attracted to the opposite, you know, in a moment, if you don't find the opposite that he has, and if he, you know, if quite, you know, vice versa, he doesn't find that sadness in, into his life. If for whatever his reason, you know, you're connecting them that way, um, then it's not gonna work. So I said to him, you know, quite clearly, I think we both agree that you need to be alone. And it, it, it's when you're ready to make that step to, 
to say, I'm sorry, you know, it's not, this is not what I need. It's quite a lot to, to, to this relationship that, you know, uh, I haven't figured out and that's, that's me. That's, I need to be comfortable being myself. I need to be comfortable being alone before I be with someone else. Right? A lot of people don't get that. A lot of people think that by being with someone else, um, you know, they will be complete. Other people don't make you complete. All right? When, when you try to find someone who can complete you in whatever way, unless you find these qualities in you and you become like him, it ain't gonna work. It just ain't gonna work. You know, if you're loud and, and spontaneous and the other person is quite the opposite, he may be attracted to you in the moment. But if you don't, if he doesn't find these qualities in himself or herself, then after a while, you know, they will be, oh my God, why are you yelling all the time? Why are you so, you know, unorganized, disorganized? What's happening, right? And you'll be like, well, I didn't change. You know, this is exactly who you met. This is exactly who you fell in love with, right? So relationships are not based on two halves. When you realize that you don't need anyone to function and when, you're ha when you can be happy by yourself, when, when you realize that in your life, the person who you meet, it's indescribable. Um, they will match you, you know, you like attracts like. And if you feel complete and you feel happy you, and you don't feel a need to have someone or to be with someone else, then you would attract someone like this. And guess what? There is no dependency there, right? There's no neediness there. Because both of you are separate electrons, if you will, and you can exist on your own. So there's no, you know, there's no need for that. But yes, you do enjoy your company, you want to share your life, you wanna, you wanna, you know, build something together because you have the same vision of what life is. You know, you relate at the different levels, from values to experience to whatever and that changes everything a lot of people nowadays they look at um, other people and judge whether they could be in a relationship based on their looks and I'm not gonna lie I did that in in, 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 in my past and I think it's it's just our society how we grow up into it people don't really tell you this unless you learn it yourself some people still do it when they're 40 50 60 years old um, and they're not in tune with themselves this is what you know, I wanted to, to cover in this and I want to work with people and, you know, help them, help people realize, you know, what is it that they want? What is it that they need? You know, what are they getting? What are they not getting? You know, a life coach is someone that adds value to someone's life by building a strategy around where you are now and where do you want to go? Uh, in a lot of the cases, it could be just from, you know, being uh, in a shitty relationship onto moving on to you know the the real soulmate or the person who you want to fall in love for the rest of your life or you know what do i have to do to to get to the next stage at work or you know who do i have to become um it, all these questions that we normally don't feel comfortable asking we avoid subliminally or even consciously so this is my, you know, this is my reason why I'm here. This is why I'm doing it. Um, I've, I'm, I'm currently working with clients and I'm enjoying every second of it. Um, I see fulfillment in, in, you know, in the progress that they, they achieve. Um, we, we've, we've achieved good progress so far and I, and I only can see that we can do more and we can do better. Um, yeah, that's all for now. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Um, this is probably one of the first videos I've ever posted. Um, yeah, feel free to contact me on my website or you know email zumpolov at zumpolov.com or zumpolov.com as my website. And yeah, I'll see you soon. Have a good day. Bye.